Okay, we're here with Simone Forcad at the Whistler Olympic Park. Simone, how was your preparation for the uh, upcoming Olympic Games? Uh, my, my preparation was good. I have been uh, one week in Nantes Selva for the last World Cup to train with a psychologue and uh, with a physiotherapist. Uh, and just to be a bit relaxed and do some altitude training. And after I moved with uh, the team uh, to Mount Washington during one week, and uh, we prepare a bit uh, harder with some intensity. And uh, we move now since uh, Monday uh, in uh, in uh, Olympic Village uh, in, in, in Whistler. And uh, now it's the last uh, we prepare the last little things for the competition. So how do you feel about having the yellow bib and coming to the Olympic Games with the yellow bib? Is this almost a impossible dream? Uh, I don't know if it's impossible because I did it, but uh, yeah, yeah, of course it's a, it's a dream who, uh, which comes true now because uh, I have the yellow bib on my shoulders. It's a, it's a dream since I'm really, uh, really, really young. So uh, it's a nice thing. It shows that I've been uh, really stable uh, on uh, on the race uh, since the beginning of season, and um, I'm really happy about it. Now it's uh, Olympic Games, and I'm really concentrated about uh, Olympics and not about the, the yellow bib. I have to do my race here to to hope a uh, Olympic medal. Final question: Your brother's on the Olympic team. Did you ever expect that the two of you would be on the same Olympic team? Uh, I think not three years before, but uh, last year my brother showed that uh, he could do uh, great things, and uh, he grow fast. And uh, now he is with me, so it's something magic for both of us. And I think, uh, and I hope we will do uh, great things uh, in Olympics here. Okay, congratulations.